Hi everybody, monopolistic competition in the long run, how do you draw the diagram? Let's go straight to our mental checklist. We want to show elastic revenue curves because that's the market structure. Slightly differentiated products, but nowhere near as much market power as monopoly. And especially normal profit, that's going to be very important to show. That defines the long run in monopolistic competition. So how do we construct it? Well, first we start by labeling our axis. So price, costs, and revenue, as we're used to doing, on market structure diagrams, and quantity on the x-axis. Right, then it's useful just having this little structure in mind, this little chain, this order of how to draw this diagram. It's like the monopoly diagram, but we have to draw a few different things in a different order than we're used to. But one thing that doesn't change is we start with the revenue curve. So again, draw them slightly more elastic than you're used to. So AR and MR, like that. Revenue curves first. Then, draw your marginal cost curve. We're used to drawing our average cost curve next. But don't do that here. Draw your marginal cost curve first. It's going to help you get the normal profit uh, level right. So, marginal cost, a night tick like we're used to, like that. Then, you want to show your profit maximization, price and quantity. We know that firms profit maximize where marginal cost equals marginal revenue. So let's go there. That takes us to Q1. And the price we can read off the AR curve, call it P1. Right, next, what we need to draw is an average cost curve, but that's tangential to average revenue, at the profit maximizing quantity. So basically, an average cost curve that touches AR there. But that can't be the minimum. The minimum has still got to cut marginal cost. Right, so we've got to make sure that when it, we draw the AC tangential at this point, it's not the minimum point. So basically, you draw it something like this. All right, so down, down and down, and then the minimum like there. Okay, and that's absolutely perfect. So that's what you've got to do. All right, draw it so it just touches at this point here, tangential there, and then the minimum so that it's cutting MC. That is the diagram, all right? And therefore, we've shown normal profit. So now at Q1, AC is equal to AR. We have shown normal profit right there. Perfect. Now we go to our checklist, how we label our axis. Yes, we have. How we labeled all of our curves. Yes, we have. Easy to forget doing one of those, so make sure you do it right. Have you labeled the equilibria? Have we done it? Yes, we have. The elastic revenue curves have been done. Normal profit has been shown nice and clearly. All right, so the diagram has been ace, and all the key things that we need to have shown have been shown on this diagram. Practice this one. Very simple once you know this little chain here. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next video.